Calibration Weld Table Calibration Supplied with your real weld system is a small plastic tube filled with calibration markers. We begin by calibrating the weld table in the following manner. If calibrating for the first time, install the fixture table. Lock in the fixture table in the horizontal position 1 using the red handled table clamps. If recalibrating, remove everything from the weld fixture table. Slide the covers open on the three camera lenses. Place the three calibration markers onto the real weld table. Position the calibration markers in these specific locations. Two markers go over the front dowel pins and the third should go on either side of the angle cutout as shown. Do not move the calibration markers once placed. Verify that nothing is placed in the view of the cameras during calibration, including the gun. This will cause the cameras to focus on the object and not on the calibration markers. Log in as the instructor. Press the button labeled Fixture Calibration. Now you will see four new tabs appear on the bottom left side of the menu. Weld Table Position 1. Press Position 1 and then press Calibrate. A new pop-up screen appears. Press the Start Calibration button located in the center of the screen. Position 1 is calibrated after the green check mark appears. Weld Table Position 2. Next, reposition the weld table to Position 2. Lock the weld table in Position 2 using the top red handled clamp. Press Position 2 and then press Calibrate. A new pop-up screen appears. Press Start Calibration to calibrate Position 2. Position 2 is calibrated after the green check mark appears. Weld Table Position 3 Reposition the weld table to Position 3. Once in Position 3, lock the weld table in place using the top red handled clamp. Press Position 3 and then press Calibrate. A new pop-up screen appears. Press Start Calibration to calibrate Position 3. Position 3 is calibrated after the green check mark appears. Tool Calibration Your real weld system is shipped already calibrated for use with the supplied Magnum Pro MIG and flux cord gun, as well as the stick electrode holder. If recalibration becomes necessary in the future, use the following steps to recalibrate any of your tools. Log in to the Real Weld Instructor mode and press Tool Calibration located on the left side of the menu screen. Press New. Enter a tool ID name and press OK. Enter the Tool Manufacturer Tool Model and select a welding process used for this tool and then press Save. Calibrate Tool. To calibrate any weld tool, you will need to use the two marker calibration rod. Slide open all three camera lenses before performing any calibration. To get started with GMAW gun calibration, first install the target device onto the GMAW gun. To do this, slide the target onto the bracket pre-installed on the gun. Twist the target set screw knob until it locks in place and attach the cable from the gun to the target device. MIG gun calibration. Under the Tool Calibration tab, press the tool you wish to calibrate. For example, after selecting the GMAW gun, press the Open button. This will prompt an edit screen showing the previously entered gun information. Install the included gun contact tip adapter onto the two marker calibration rod. Remove the gas cone and contact tip from the GMAW gun. Thread the real weld 2 marker calibration rod into the contact tip threads on the gun nozzle. Be sure to remove all tools and materials from the weld table. Press the gear icon located in the last calibration update column. Hold the gun within the field of view of the real weld cameras. Make sure the gun is held as steady as possible during the calibration process. Press Start Calibration and hold the gun steady. Save the calibration by pressing the floppy disk icon and exit out of the edit screen. Stick electrode holder calibration. Transfer the target device from the GMAW gun to the bracket installed on the electrode holder. Be sure to lock down the set screw and connect the target device cable. 
Use the 5 inch metal calibration rod with the threaded open end for electrode holder calibration. Fasten the 2 marker calibration rod to the 5 inch metal rod. After selecting the electrode holder on the screen, press the open button. This will prompt an edit screen showing the previously entered electrode holder information. Press the wrench icon which correlates to electrode angle. Select the electrode angle that you wish to calibrate. Then, insert the calibration marker electrode rod into the electrode holder at the same electrode angle. Be sure the calibration rod is flush with the clip on the electrode holder as shown on the screen. Then, exit out of the screen. Press the gear icon located in the last calibration update column. Hold the electrode holder within the field of view of the real weld cameras. Press Start Calibration and hold the electrode holder extremely steady. Save the calibration after the green check mark appears by pressing the floppy disk icon. Repeat these steps until all three electrode angles have been calibrated, 60, 90, and 120 degrees. Do not calibrate zero degrees. Once all three angles have been calibrated and saved, exit out of the edit screen. Close all three camera lens holders. Thank you for taking the time to learn how to install and set up your new RealWeld system. If you have any questions, please contact us directly.